Hey. ID? That's cute. <laughs> I'm Jack Gordon. There's my ID right there. Where? There's one guy in the photo. Aw, oh, you wish you were that guy. I don't know they allowed pets in the office now. Or is that one of those special dogs that weird people can take anywhere? Oh, you're not allowed to ask if it's a emotional support animal. I think I have my answer. Jack Gordon, it is so incredible to meet you. I'm Clark, online content curator. Hi, Clark. Obviously made up job title. You are the reason I got into outdoor journalism. I heard you were coming in today, so I reread your book. That's a penis. <sighs> Mason! Sorry. Uh, hey, do you mind stopping by the digital department? Oh, I'm actually supposed to meet Roland, so Oh, nice! It's on the way! By the way, I got the same Moab boots you called lifesavers when you were stranded in Denali National Park. Oh, you do a lot of mountain climbing in midtown Chicago? <laughs> None. My feet are crazy sweaty. Come on. <laughs> Uh, guys, this is V. Jack Gordon. Jack, this is a social influencer, Emma. Oh my God, you're a legend. I can't believe you're here. It's actually pretty excited for her. <clears throat> and this is our digital conversation specialist, Mason. Oh, Mason, it's nice to put a face to the penis. Not always. Uh, oh, let me help hey, you with this look, pack here. Oh, the oh. new. Uh... <laughs> The new EV2. I didn't know this bad boy was out. <laughs> There's a sick kid in there wearing a diaper. Oh, that's, uh, that's Seb. He can't leave the tent for 30 days. We got a 24-7 video feed. Meals, bathroom, everything in that tent. Yeah, also Zeb's demoing this new underwear that's so rad. They claim you don't have to change them for two weeks. Yeah, those aren't working out. And good news, we just had our most retweeted online poll. Best outdoor gear for the zombie apocalypse. Yeah, nailed it! Can you guess the number one zombie killing tool? Uh, remembering zombies don't exist? <laughs> no, it was ten spikes, but we didn't give you enough time. Oh, yes, ten spikes. You're so right and so diverse. Uh, so, good luck with your curating and pooping and genital photos. Uh, I'm gonna go see the guy who runs the real magazine. I'll think of you on my flight to Patagonia. Not as smart as he thinks. Patagonia's like three blocks away. Roland. Jack! 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 The bird a nest, the spider a web, man, friendship. It takes two to make a thing go right. Oh, I missed you, Jack. Sorry to have pulled you out of the wild. I know you don't like that. What can I get you to restore your aging spirits? Oh, I'll have what you're having. Oh, then you'll be having your third scotch of the morning. I never saw this. Your Sherpa thanked you? Oh, Passang, yes, yes. I carried him down K2. I get more credit for that than I deserve, to be honest. It was either him or my backpack, and he weighed considerably less than my pack. Mm. <laughs> they are a tiny, tiny people. <laughs> <laughs> Roland, you okay? Well, to be honest, Jack, not everything is rosy at the ranch. This month is our last print issue. The magazine is done? No. Like Newsweek and many others, it'll continue as a website. So the magazine is done. <laughs> Not without a fight. To that end, I've considerably beefed up our online resources. Well, resources is a strong word for the digital daycare division I just met. Walking. My boy, you know how much you mean to this magazine. This walk is suddenly feeling very green mild to me. How can I best put it? There's a, there's a German folktale called Der Wolf auf seinem Totenbett. And I would tell it to you now, but this hallway is shorter than I remember. And we're already here. Where? Behold your new assignment. Jack, hey, look, I tied my own knot. 